<laughs> Mr. Thyrox, thank you for 85. Any instrument lighting in this. No, I, yeah. What do you need lights for? Does it, what, do you, well, if it's the instrument lighting, then the instruments. We're bush flying. Oh, do, 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 do. No, yeah, but I, I'm, I'm a lighting guy. I like things to look pretty, okay? It's not got RGB in it. Yeah. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Phillips, you. <laughs> 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 Okay, it's fine. I found some panel lighting. That will do for me. I'm a happy man. So, like, I see you guys, right? But you you don't have your, like, tabs in uh, over your names anymore. Why don't you have a yoke in front of you, Daniel? Yeah. Because I'm using the Thrustmaster stuff, and I'd have to remove this wheelbase to put a yoke there, which I may do at some point. This bus driver, I don't know what he's doing. He's crazy. So how oh, get T-bombed. And know what the pattern is. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Taste us, Foxy. Stay healthy, sir. So if we had different window. deliveries, I mean, that'd be fun. You prefer a Yoko Josh? Like, I really don't. I, 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 I can fly. Oh, I mean, literally, I've flown planes with either. Like, I trained on a plane with a stick, and now I'll fly a plane with a yoke. There's, there's not really any difference. I guess with a stick you get more buttons to hand, so it's kind of useful. But with a yoke you get like, I don't know, you get a bit more fine grain control. Can we figure it all out? Yeah, we should be fine. I'm just trying to remember where the uh, option to see people's names is on, on uh, top of the... It, it's in Escape General Traffic, I think. That, cool. Yeah, that's correct. I just switched it. Yeah, it's the fourth one down in traffic. I'm set to on, but I can't see anyone. I can now. I can see yours. Well, I can see yours and cats, but I can't see candles and squirrels, which is weird. That's uh, because you're too close to them. Oh, uh, okay. So you've got to be far enough away for it to. Yes. Happen. Yeah. You get close. Yeah. The the nameplate will disappear. You get even closer, and the plane will disappear. Yeah. It's not only yeah, that. We, if we it, the ghost thing yesterday, it was, it's actually really good. I if think. you press escape to go to your menu, you disappear from the you game from us. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's turn really off the label. Uh, Where do I turn them uh, General settings and then traffic. And it, yeah, name labels. I'm gonna turn them off. Oh, shit. What's the actual trim in this thing? Oh. General. Traffic. Ty, right. what is the um, trim in this thing? The trim? Say again. Where's the trim? I'm like visually looking for its takeoff position, oh. but I don't know where it is. Uh, it'll be on the G3X somewhere. Uh, it's usually right next to the uh, CDI, so uh, in real life on the um, on the G3X just left of it, you'll see a little indicator. Ah, uh, yeah, I see it. Next to the little compass rose. That's very tiny. That is really small. That doesn't even it have doesn't a have a takeoff take setting yet. I think you just set it and you sort of just Dre, go. you're gonna love the berry flavored wife food, mate. All, uh, I'm gonna have a coconut later. Center. I've got it's a coconut one trip. in the fridge. I've not tried coconut yet, but the berry one's fantastic. Alright, well I'm ready to roll. Are we all ready to rock and roll? Yes sir. Autobots roll out. Yes, Where are we going northwest? Uh north uh, I was gonna say northeast up the up the river takes us to the next to a, to an airport eventually. It might give us some spots to go land on sandbars and whatnot. You mean attempt to land on them in my case? Well, I, I know, I know hey, that Grizzle, we don't have a glass cockpit here in an auto land, but I think you'll, you're going to be okay. Uh, which, uh, uh, Kendra, I think what a compass was yesterday, so... You know, uh, so, Chewy, what's a compass? Am I the only one seeing this, uh, this tower right oh, in yeah. there? <laughs> Thank you for the very quick change of subject. I'm going this yeah. way. I <laughs> know uh, the tower is there. Yeah, Will this turn into a catastrophe? Probably. Yeah, that's weird. I had a, at Page, Arizona, I had a trap uh, landing light in the taxiway. I found it. Uh, Paul, you didn't indicate. <laughs> Sorry, I cut you up there. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Cat Strader, you want to do formation takeoff? Absolutely. You want lead? Uh, now I want to slot in if I can. Roger. Um, I'll uh, slot in on you. 
Right. Formation takeoff. Oh yeah. <laughs> if you can uh, scoot to the left, then I'll slot in on the right. Well, are you going to take lead? Uh, I'm going to sit at the back somewhere here. Get a nice view. Yeah, I'm zero clue where I'm going. Are you ready? Are we all here? Not yet. Oh, I'm ready. ready. I am ready. Oh my god, that's so scary when you hit the brakes and it just goes <gasps> forward. Oh. <laughs> Best oh, gamer, thank you very much for the bits, sir. Gotta get an outside view here. Thank you. Use cows, thank you for months. Come on over the lead right at the Valkyries when we take off. Ugh. Well, I'm you in know, position. Get the MC8 on Twitch, feels bad, man. <laughs> I think we're good to go, right? Yeah, we're good to go. Okay, here we go. I'm just assuming the guy in front of me is not under my propeller because I can't see him yet. Oh, there he is. Don't worry, I'm at the back. I can see you again. Oh my god! <laughs> nice take off. Am I wrong? This is terrifying. <laughs> I kind of wish I wasn't the one in front. Die speed up! The guy I'm going as fast as I can, dude. Why don't you pitch your nose up and climb a little bit? I'm right off your like if you look out your left window, hello? Oh hey. Hello. So that's hey. the right side. Oh jeez. Well I'm gonna turn that way just so you know. That's fine. that's cool. What's the guy in the back? Is that the slot? Oh look at that. Like Thunderbird 4? I can't remember what it's called, the slot. That is the slot name for him. Yes. yes, Thunderbird 4. Uh, not JP, the... you are now Thunderbird 4. Continue. <laughs> <laughs> There's a there's a labelless guy. Oh, there he is. Oh, go on. Do we know if the game will support VR? Um, I think VR support comes in October to the um, HP VR device, and then probably others will be supported later. Just pretend like you know what you're talking about, sorry. Just not in the manifold pressure. Uh, upper right gauge. Gotcha. Man in. On air for 22 inches. <laughs> Man in. <laughs> uh, ZF sideways cyanide, correct. Yes. <laughs> Meanwhile, everybody's regretting their decision. <laughs> <laughs> so have we, uh, have we found out any local information about the area that we're in? Yeah, the fact that we're supposed to be going north and not south. I was wondering why we're not going northwest. <laughs> I was going to say. <laughs> So no, we're just gonna we're just gonna overfly the field and head north here. So don't worry about, about that. Andy, on. Andy, Mark Three, yeah, thank you. Right. Welcome Tell back. Tell me about a compass, Chewy. Like You're welcome, Jplay. The uh, episode two tutorial going out today. That's going to cover peripherals, and then you've got episode three so covers cameras. FMGCs for um, this episode four is like first flight. Uh, uh, yeah, that Chewy. That's on Chewy YouTube. Knows all that stuff, right? He's gonna um, he's gonna program his uh, program his Ink McDo and auto thrust it in. <laughs> Twenty two inches. Is <laughs> <laughs> this is I'm not, I'm not saying anything. I'm not saying a word. <laughs> Squirrel is being very quiet. <laughs> yeah, I'm just Sorry. taking it all in. He regrets his he's got, he's got a bleep button on his keyboard that he's just basically perpetually pressing. <laughs> Alright, I'm I'm done. You're good. Are hey. we heading north now? Yes. Yeah, we're heading north. Uh, now. Big so part, there's that. no real difference between the two. Very, if you it's buy very it on pretty. Steam, it imports your Steam friends into the game. Um, if you buy it on the Xbox Store, I mean, the only re the only pragmatic difference is if you buy it in the I Windows really Store. Cool the when there's updates, they'll probably so roll out much. immediately and then Steam a little bit later. Yeah, I've I'm been guessing. pretty impressed as a whole with the multiplayer. Um, yeah. You know, some some missteps here and there trying to get things up and running, but. Uh, every time I've done this, like, now that we've got it set up, it should just work. Yeah. Yeah, it's it, pretty it, good. Like, it's smooth, all the surfaces work, you can hear sounds, like, it's just fantastic. The lights like, are relatively like, accurate as well. A like, cat being chased by a squirrel. Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah, when you're doing some night stuff, too, it looks, it looks, it looks fantastic. Have you guys tried to There's a like, Wookiee chasing both of us. Uh, not really. A little bit, but not a ton. Yeah, if you have a game I mean, pass, VFR you can play it on the uh, store as well. Um, anything VFR scares me, so night VFR will scare me even more so. Night VFR is amazing. Uh, it's, yeah. 
I watched your video on it, Paul, before this this embargo was lifted and stuff, um, and it blew my mind. Yeah. You, you gotta try it. It's so good. We're Just basically like the blue angels right now. Say again? I said we're basically the blue angels right now. It's pretty awesome. Hell yeah. Hundred percent. The view off the right wing with all the atmospheric scattering is like that's the kind of stuff that gets me. Yeah. I've just I think I've just gone inside a squirrel. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody just pointed out that a squirrel's chasing a cat right now, which is a bit weird. <laughs> <laughs> and then a Wookiee's off the right hand wing of the cat. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, the atmospheric lighting is just incredible. And I, I think what makes it so much more impressive is the fact that you can change it instantly and have a completely different vibe in the sim by changing the weather settings within a second. No loading screens or anything. Yeah. So, so that's, that's like you... almost the key, though. Like it's it's the good lighting that gives the entirety of the world depth. Yeah. You know, it's the lighting and atmospherics that give the world Look at that. depth. There's a light, doesn't it? By the way, you're Have watching you in 21.9 ratio the right changing now. Changing of lighting with the current version of the client? Uh, yeah, well, I was changing just things on the live mode yesterday. Because I noticed yesterday, every time I changed the time, it would the sim would pause for like 10 seconds. Oh, interesting. I had three Did he like, make it? big stutters for like about 10 seconds or yeah. so yesterday, but that was in 12 he made hours, it. so it wasn't bad. <laughs> I had three crashed to desktops yesterday. <laughs> I, I had one. Candris had one. We did some bush flying yesterday, and Candris had one, didn't he? I only I only I got had, CTDs. I had today. That's been yeah. bad today. I only really? got CTDs plugging in uh, gear. Once if the sim's open, when you plug something in, it just poops. Uh, what's yeah. the PlayFab thing? My Xbox controller that keeps crashing it. Funny enough. <laughs> yeah, it's like disconnecting and reconnecting. Um, input seems to be the, the most dangerous thing you can do right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it does crash the sim quite a bit when you disconnect controllers. This is just phenomenal. I'm spending so much time concentrating on like not like on actually staying in formation that I'm not really spending too much time looking at the view but I mean I've got my face pressed against the window. <laughs> it's crazy right? Speaking of that view, look at that. You can do a loose formation and look out the window. No, I want to be as close to uh, as We're I in Alaska at the moment. Yeah. I haven't seen you this year, so I need to get my film. I know, man. Close contact with Cat. So, Leonard, thank you for oh, 31 months. Let me just ask if we get prop wash if we go behind the others. I don't no. know if we do. Didn't, didn't notice that. That'd no. be cool, though. I think, the, I think the atmosphere is like the wind is supposed to um, interact with buildings uh, the same way that it does mountains. I think that was yeah. the thing they talked about. Uh, yeah, I got you, Mavis. Yeah, I've not watched all of that well, yet. It's supposed to, anyway. I only watched the first 10 minutes, and then I had to do something else. I'm going to start climbing here. I'm going to go 25 inches and just start a little slow climb. We need to find something to fly under or land on. Yeah. Keep an eye out. For sure. And then a river. No, there's, there's a glitch right ahead. I see that glitch. That is hilarious. J JP, you're the bush pilot, man. You want to you wanna tell us where to go? Look at that glitch. I mean, we can definitely do some stuff to the left here, but it depends how challenging. Do we want to ramp it up, or do we want to start, like, pretty, pretty bad? Let's ramp it up, because some of the guys here haven't flown this plane before, I don't think. All right, yeah, you head to the left. Uh, we got some fields with some trees. That makes it pretty easy. And then in the distance, I see the river goes towards some mountains, so it should be quite nice. nice. You want to try one of these fields here right under our wing? Yeah, this looks uh, reasonable. OK. Do you a lead in cast? Thank you, Kevin. You <clears throat> yeah. All right, I see the spot. What What are the speeds that we should be going for with this thing? Uh, basically until your stall warning comes in, and then just add power and fly it on the stall warning. Cool. This thing floats like you wouldn't believe. Uh, there's a grassy patch off my left wing right now, just the other side of the lake. There, I'm gonna try try for. Yeah, I think I see the one you want to make. Oh, yeah, I got you. Let's hope we're all talking about the same patch of grass. <laughs> no, if we're not, it's fine. <laughs> Doesn't look terribly flat. We, we can have a game of hide-and-seek. Can you imagine? 
I think he means that one. So you just say as you're hearing that stall tone, just add power, just so you don't drop out the sky. Yeah, Dewey, where you are right now looks perfect to me. Yeah, that's where I'm going. I'm so lost. Five hundred. We're landing on the grass. A little bit faster. But, <laughs> very helpful, thank you. Oh, I see squirrel. I see all of you. See if we can get it down. <laughs> nice. I think again, Canner's like Jay told me this. Like the the key to bush flying is momentum. I'm so used to idling the throttles whenever I touch down, but you really don't need to Oof, do that. In that's this, a bit hard, especially if you're landing uphill. Like you're just gonna stop, and that's it. You're that was a bit of a hard touchdown. I think I almost hit the tree. <laughs> I think I spoke my coffee landing that. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, there was a few. I got a couple. I got a two for a three for one. Oh, bounce. Chat confirms there was no tree hit. Well, we just landed like in a random bit of terrain and all the yeah. levels are modeled like this is not flat. This is undulating. Right. I'm, I'm finding like at airports like Innsbruck, for example, there's nowhere near like the terrain differences that we've got here, but you can see the real kind of dips in the grass and it feels like complete flat land. Yeah. But I mean, I guess that's a really tricky thing to model to such a degree, especially when you've got this much detail already. Does that have the same keyboard oh, maxing yeah. as P3? Um, yeah. Some of them definitely does, like G for gear, B for barometer, that kind of thing. Uh, the throttle keys on the function keys. The problem with Canvas is that he makes these things look so easy. So you try and copy what he does, and it, it doesn't go very well. <laughs> oh, it's all <laughs> energy, man. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't almost just have an accelerated stall. Don't worry. <laughs> Oh, I just uh, about we're, we're not following. Are we still following me? Or are we following JP now? Uh, we're well, following you. Because yeah. <laughs> I was following you. <laughs> Got it up. Just All right, we'll head to the north. We'll Do we have track on our five? Go, yes. go towards this water, see if we can find some more. We literally were just following each other. <laughs> well, I'm following JP. JP following you. Like, dude. Size up there. Okay, we good. So we can we find a maybe like a sandbank near a river or something? Yeah. Yeah, we'll go up to this water. There's some water ahead of us. We'll see if we can find something. I didn't see anything on the river coming in a sec except for like next to that airport. Um, there's a bigger section of this river up further north. We might have some luck there on that that like almost reservoir looking thing. I don't know if you see it on your map. And if anybody spots a clearing, just say the word. Word. What parts of the glove are they at? What do you mean? Got my tail number on there. Going in for landing down there, or just showboating Candoras? Little column A, little column D. I just love. I enjoy low level on the sim. It's uh, rare that it acts so good. Close oh to the my god! Look to the right side. Look out your right wing right now. Look at that road. <laughs> Can we try and land on that. Wow, that is something. <laughs> Can we try and land on that, please? That's glorious. Well, I'm giving it a go, I don't care. Uh, what is uh, that road? You know what? I'm, I'm following you. I'm gonna kind of Oh, that's that. amazing. I, I've, I've got to land on that. Even got cars on it, did it? Damn. Got to land on that. Down you go! <laughs> <I'm in> the <laughs> <edge>. <laughs> yeah, it's a bit bumpy. I'm way too fast. Oh god, this is not gonna go well, I can tell. I'm just going to get like down, lose some speed first. Oh, that is vertical. That is <laughs> vertical. Oh, God, there's no problem. 
Woohoo! Oh god! It's fine. It's fine. Not end well. I was a bit more drunk. Jesus mode quickly if we go on our roof. That's uh, that's Twin Peaks Airport. Now I've got to find you guys again. <laughs> I'm gonna get over that ridge first. Yeah, I'm dead, guys. I can't see a thing. Uh -oh. I landed. Did you get that? Okay, so. Yeah. I'm stuck on a on a hill at the moment. I'm having to roll backwards just to get some momentum. I can't see a thing. What? Well, <gasps> okay, I've just run into the terrain. Um, I think I found a bug. Uh, did did you now? Where's the ground? Yeah. I discovered Middle Earth yesterday. That looks like a bug, but, you know. Is it possible to take off back? That was a bit tough. Up, anything's possible. Oh, God. <laughs> the only limitations are your dreams. You see that squirrel in front of me? Brace, brace, brace. What is going like on? Like that little slice of earth. Yeah, I've just got, I think I see the same thing you do. Yeah, I just bonked into it. And just just that, went, nope, so turn around. You just bounce off that. Yeah, you bonk straight off. I just cannot get ahead one. I'm stuck on some really crazy terrain. <laughs> See it. <laughs> if we can go around it. Into caravans. It should be fun. <laughs> oh, that is pretty solid. Yeah, it's that's quite solid. Fine. Can I get I'm a pushback? I'm down a hill and all I want to do is turn myself around to get the momentum of it. But <laughs> Use the it's a fault line. <laughs> Yeah. Right. This is a great camera. There we go. All right, guys. I'm just gonna step uh, aside just for a second. Leave my plane flying. I smell fire, so I'm just gonna go check on that. Oh. Uh, okay. Watch that. It's fine. It's probably just choose pilot's license. Hello. That's not good. Right. Okay. Oh, oh my I god, this is guys. like... <laughs> yeah, there's a, there was a spot next to this lake over here that I was trying to get into. And, oh, uh, my life. I think I can do I've it. I've never taken off on a road with like a truck coming at me before. Where are you at? <laughs> uh, that's mm -hmm. difficult to say. Yeah, I'm just yeah. trying to... Is it Chewy? Hello? <laughs> yeah, you're flying towards me now. That yeah, is scary. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mr. Jones, uh, thank you for the bits. Uh, tires. Uh, he's literally dead ahead of me, so he okay. should be dead ahead of you as well. Can you not see his uh, Thank you, Auburn. Works? Oh, now I see him. What's the aim of this game besides flying? It's a flying sim. There's no aim apart from flying. You do what you like in it. Have a bit of fun, take it seriously, do whatever. Visit the world, right. try different aircraft, Sorry, airing, but it is just flying. All right, I'm back, uh, guys. Little, little grass it's like playing a golf game and saying, is there any golf in this? Uh, yeah, there's only golf in this. the neighborhood. I hear fire trucks, but it's not my house, so uh, not much I can do. I'm surprised my plane stayed in the air. Impressive. Yeah. I'm surprised your pilot tell us you were leaving. Are you landing down there, Ty, or are you? Oh just, my just God, God, that, that is some terrain down there, Jesus. Do you stream next to planes functions? Yes, I do. Yeah, I do. Um, for example, the stream deck, can you see the stream deck on the right here? Uh, if I click that, that goes to my different instrument right, views. Squirrel. There you are. That's one thing I can do. Uh, over on the left here, I can control on my lighting, so I can put the landing light on and off. I can change yeah, autopilot, V speeds, uh, oh, heading, US altitude, yeah. put the gear down, flaps are here, parking brake. So loads of controls are here, and then loads of cameras are over there. Obviously pretty but I'm still, now, I'm still working on this. Pick up a little bit once this goes public, but an airline career would I mean, be nice. I assume it's running on Xbox Live. You're probably going to get that yeah. from external stuff. Place you're probably not going to see that in flight sim. Like you probably get a third party thing. Uh, I'm on your five o'clock, Mr. Squirrel. Good, because I'm trying to circle around and find people. Oh, those can't straight up. The cub will not climb the hill. So who's following who? Yeah. I'm on the ground. But you're the leader. 
So wow. everyone else. Yeah, FS Economy already works with it if you install uh, Sim Connect and uh, you listen on a port 500 or something. It is completely possible right now. What do you land on there, Ty? Hopes and dreams. <laughs> and do you not see a little break in the scenery? Yeah, I'm just trying to work out which way you came in from the water side. I yeah. came in, so I came in from the left, actually, from the left of my. Well, you can't. This is where you're flying now, Paul. Right. But you could get in, kind of how Chewie's doing, I think. Maybe oh. if you went a little slower than that. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Coming in at V1. <laughs> Right, I'm going to try and get down there then. Honestly, this adds a whole new element to flight simming. It's it's so good. I agree. But when we we did it like a week or two ago, we were just blown away by it. Got to try and find you guys now. I'm. Five hundred. She was in the forest, yeah, chewing trees. Yeah, you might even have more luck coming in towards the water. Oh my god, this, I'm doing this kite tag Because there's that. There's that big hill there that'll keep you from going into the water, ostensibly. I got this. All right, here we go. I'm so glad damage is turned off when I'm going through these trees like this. I tell you what, I'm going to take off because I've completely lost you guys. So I'm going to oh, get airborne again and come back. Big bonk! Brakes! Oh, oh, you got yeah. it, cyanide. No! <laughs> oh, I think I've got too much speed. Uh, hey, bro. I got too much speed Shinky. going on. Stuck. Way too much speed going on. Oh, just press Y and I then Y again. <laughs> ah, there you are. Oh, oh boy. My God, dude. Oh, whips. Slow down. That happens. You, you also clipped the tree, but we won't talk about that. Oh, God. Slow down. Yeah, there's definitely goes in the tree. Stop. So the direction of what I should have done. Rip. So I knew Paul goes deep in the trees. Oh yeah, I could not stop that. Oh man, that's about 10, 15 meters too far. I mean, actually pretty doable. Uh, hi, Ty. Yeah, I had too much uh, speed not, on approach. Not, not when you're Dewey doing that. <laughs> <laughs> Little bit too much momentum coming in. So like over the water, I should have been at nearly stall speed, but I was doing about 60 knots. Just call him Bushmaster. Yes. Excuse me. Right. I feel I'm like thinking. I'm thinking it might be easier to take off from the other way. <clears throat> I don't know though. Use it as a ramp. Well, there's a ramp near the water though. I reckon that'll work. You go from the top yeah, there, like that's the answer going down the hill, maybe, yeah. Thank you for half a year, on Steam. Parking brake stuck on. What? Oh, yeah, top of the hill, we should be okay. See, I landed from this direction. I landed from uh, the south here. Yeah. I reckon I can get out this way. We'll find out. And it was dicey, but. Oh, I'm supposed to be lead, aren't I? How did this happen? Then? Oh, boy. <laughs> I mean, you don't have to be. No. Oh, oh, no. Oh, momentum has got me. Oh, that ski jump's nice. <laughs> Did it. I'm in the water. I'm out of the water. Everybody He's in the water. <laughs> uh, does the water still fly you in there? I think if you have damage turned off, then you, you bounce off everything. If you have damage turned on and you hit the water, it's probably going to cause structural damage. Oh, this, that's a bit low, Ty. Say again? That was a bit low over the water, though. Did you hit those trees? Uh, you know, don't worry about it. <laughs> stall horn blazing at me the whole time coming up. It's fine. The thing with like previous, like one thing that I've not really paid much attention to is the fact that with this much vegetation in other sims, like frame rate would be through the floor. Yeah. Yeah, they've done a really good job optimizing. Ah, <laughs> uh, 
dear. Yes, there's a, the Icon A5 is a water landing plane. I've, I've run into performance issues around some cities and with a bunch of clouds, but like out here, it's running fantastic. Like my machine's barely, barely even breaking a sweat. Yeah, if the weather was like cloudy, you'd you'd definitely see some frames drop. Would approve of my landing techniques with these trees being cut down. Need to improve. Oh, there's a good one, off our left here on this lake. You see the little peninsula? I don't even see you yet. Yeah. Oh, well, you're. Uh, I'm behind you now. Actually, there's a break in this. The scenery's broken. Never mind. Are we, uh, is Ty, are you leading again? Yeah, are we following you? I guess. <laughs> Whether somebody you like sees a place, not. if somebody sees a place to land, call it out. Or if I we want to go do something else. There they are. Max. Say again? Uh, up ahead, we should be able to get some riverbanks, I think. Yeah, okay. I think you're right. Looks like there's a little island up there. Uh, will frames be okay when they add VR? Um, I don't think... I don't think at the moment that it would work on VR unless they optimize it and really simplify the graphics. Because if you need, I don't know, what frames do you need you for a VR? 90? Always go back to hope, You're not going to get 90 for easily. Uh, the other day, Paul. Sorry, say again? I said if you want some riverbanks and whatnot, we can always go to Hope where we flew the other day. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it was nice down there. Yeah, they've got to sacrifice some visual quality to get high frame rates that you need for VR. The sun off the right-hand side is just beautiful. And the lighting effects on the water from it. Well, the lighting on the mountains looks really good as yeah. well. Yeah. Right, are we aiming for this uh, area here? Can you point at it for me? Uh, like the, uh, the lake beds. <laughs> yeah, that there. one down there. Yeah, that one. Well, there's a road that runs along that lake. Yeah, we could find some beaches and whatnot. Some sandbars. So where, whereabouts in Alaska is this? Do we, is it? Looks like a Bob Ross painting. Uh, it's South amazing. South Central. Yeah. South Central Alaska. It's just amazing. You can just fly to, like, random bits of the Earth so and... we're probably... You know, places you'll never visit in your life, ever. And just fly around. around. We're about 90 miles north of Anchorage. Okay. That's where they fly the 747s. <laughs> really? <laughs> Let me put it in perspective. Chewie can understand. What do you mean to me? Thank you, Giant, for subbing. <laughs> uh, you've obviously never tried VR. Warp space. I've tried VR. In the, in the but, yeah. here, like, I'm just yeah, saying VR, like, consistent frame rates are more important than visuals in VR. Otherwise, yeah, if you start stuttering, you're, you're just yeah. not going to feel good. I think I found, uh, you spent a whole yeah, week setting up flight way, plans in Sky Victor. I'm going to fly here, uh, then I'm going to fly uh, here, then I'm going to go there. Oh, is it just here, just to the right where you just passed? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, boy. Uh, oh, that's not a lot of crap. That's I think that's dude. this ingenuous big footage. Uh, when you do land, just get out of the way for everyone else because it's pretty tight in there. Oh, sorry, Tom. Didn't Wait, I missed that memo. Oh, Were we landing? Uh, just I'm going in now. So if you look out your left wing, you should see us low. Yeah. Uh, you'd be lucky if that's treated as terrain. A lot of undulations in the water here. Yeah. Oh, I'm not done that turn well. The undulations in the water make this interesting. Touchdown just at the wrong point. It's 
Chewie, you're a uh, spectacular to watch, honestly. <laughs> For all the wrong reasons. It's an example of exactly what not to do when bush flying, right? I mean, it's uh, it's a sight to behold. <laughs> Where are we going? There it is. Right, let's see if we can get in. I think I'm better in the aircraft that I was flying yesterday. Yeah, the uh, X Cub, so I've got quite a bit of time in an X Cub, and uh, this doesn't fly like the real thing. Uh, oh, really? It's work. Also, tail draggers are inherently very difficult to keep straight and level, and these, oh, sorry, straight. Oh my god, and, look at uh, the water. These, uh, are very generous. Is the other Cub any better? Oh, yeah, the Savage Cub is much better. It's uh, very, very real. It's legit. Well, let's grab that for the next one then. There we go. Down no trees were harmed in the landing. Yeah, that was the best one yet. I got it in just over stall speed just before the land mess. So the key to getting out of here is going to be to use as much room as you possibly can. Oh boy. What the hell's up with the water? Yeah, it's, it's more like the sea right now, like the North Sea. <laughs> Uh, have you seen weather real time yet? Uh, what do you mean? A GCX 1080 can easily hit 60 FPS. What? It depends what you ask the 1080 to do. It depends on the resolution you ask it to push, and the graphic settings you use, and uh, where you fly, and what the weather is. There's a ton of variables. Coffee. I need a strong drink. Oh, like, I've got a 2080 Ti, and I That's can push this thing well. easily. <laughs> if I set it up, I can make it tank downwards. Uh, you want to lead for a bit, JP? Find us somewhere good? Uh, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm ready to go. I'm pretty much lined up here, so I can uh, head straight out from here. Great. What, what flaps do you take off with from here? So you want to have no flaps until you're uh, at rotation speed, then slap them in and pull and yank it good, and you'll get off the ground real. Oh, okay. Interesting. Do you flaps on that? Let's see, actually. Wait, so take off with no flaps, and then when you rotate, bring some flaps in? Four flaps when you rotate. Was that four flaps? Sorry. Let's see. Yeah. What, full flaps when you rotate? Won't that create a load of drag? I have no idea. I'm, I'm, I'm about to get up the ground quicker, so you're, uh, you're going full forward to get the tail up as high as you can, and then during that same rotation of coming back, Slapping in the flaps, full flaps. Huh. Wow, I'd never done that before. <laughs> you just see Chewie meandering through some trees. Do it, do it a little later than I did. I am one with nature. Thank you. If you hit the water, don't worry, you get a power boost. <laughs> Is that like in Formula One when you like, there's that glitch if you hit... It's very the dangerous with the bus, why? But yep. that's down. exactly what it is. Um, I, I forget that you guys from Boston are all experts with... Huge Formula oh, One fans. I want nothing more than to watch three hours of no, no passing. Tire management, yeah, right? <laughs> yeah, tire and fuel. <laughs> Bumpy water. Yes, you can play the sim with an Xbox controller. Alright, let's try this flap thing. So, you get to the bottom, rotate, and then stick in full flaps. <laughs> right, where's Mr. JP? <laughs> 200 climbing just above the airport. <laughs> Don't sink! A little northwest. <laughs> I can't get any airspeed. <laughs> no, it was like when you're rotating, I think he said. At the point where you're rotating, then you need to be yanking back and dropping full flaps. I think I need to practice that again. I'm just following Chewie. Yeah, I'm just heading north at the moment. That didn't just... work too well. Ah, there's Jay. Oh, he's behind. I think. Randy Panda, welcome. In what direction are you going? Because we're just all heading, we're still f heading further north right now, right towards the mountain ranges. Yep. 
Follow the um, river north, I guess. Uh, I'm getting some altitude because you can see the riverbanks better from up here. So I'll stay with you guys and we'll just uh, head head wherever we're going. Cool. Yeah, I'm just so I'm just actually up the mountains. to your left there, or oh, pretty much where you are going right now. Looks pretty. Cool. In fact, it looks delicious. Bank up ahead. What do we find? Uh, river bank up ahead. Looks yeah, like the Pacific. Yeah, yeah, there's some. Um, yeah, there's, there's, there's definitely some yeah, vertical yeah, terrain mapping right. problems back there. Like here looks better. Yeah, that's what I'm. Yeah. But back yeah. there, it was undulating. Yeah, I'm gonna head down for that one. Uh, Giant, thank you very much for subbing, sir. What do I use for steering? Hang on, I'll show you on my... Look at the overhead camera there. You I'll can basically see what's going on. Ah, uh, whenever you want to. So the uh, throttle's under here, stick, <laughs> keyboard. That'd be really cool. Like skim the tires before you land? Yeah. yeah. Basically, and you're useful runway. Well, when John, thank you for I subbing. Just you go faster. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. I don't know if it's gonna register as water or sand, but. Uh, yes, MFG crosswind rudder pedals. Right up your okay. And then there's another. Yeah, the rudder pedals are down, in. down here. You can't Can see you them. See the uh, the one that's kind of like. There's like a lone tree in the middle of it, and there's like yeah, that's the pink one. Like yeah, 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 pink purple, that's what I'm aiming for right now. I'm converging then, I might beat you to it. You probably will, but that's because I'm actually going to try and try to mark one JPGs. Where are they landing? Those mountains look amazing. Oh, wow. it's got a serious incline, I don't know if this is... <laughs> Squad mode is cool. Yeah, you can see what everybody's up to. All you need is a bit of belief. This doesn't look like a... Just what are we believing in? No idea. What is this purple like? Yeah, that, that's weird. That looks like a Ben & Jerry's ice cream from here. There, there's a bank that we missed that's behind us. Not the right. One. Yeah, that's what I called out over my wing. That's a Roger. pretty nice one. We, we should go for that, but instead we're all going for Ben & Jerry's. Yeah, I'll I mean, be in that's a second. that's the right decision. That's so weird. <laughs> Hi, Cy. Oh, hello. That's good. What is I'd love it? to know if it's really this thing in real life, like whether it's salt or something. Yeah? What track are you back on? No, I don't know what the exact time it releases. Okay, right. I'd love to know how they model the water, because water is inherently always flat, so there's something funky going on here. Yeah. Mm. Where is this place? Oh, uh, it's like... Sorry, carry on, carry on. Like using the upslope, but the then like kind of running into the area where I am right now, if you... So I'm going to move out the way just in case. Oh, yeah, from where I am towards you is the perfect takeoff direction. Yeah, that's why I'm moving. I'm aiming that way right now. I absolutely love, like, I adore the fact that in this sim you can do stuff like this, like we're doing right now, but potentially in the future also fly like 11 hours across mm -hmm. the Atlantic. Like, I, I think that's excellent. That's it, isn't it? It takes like a few seconds for you to be, you know, like yesterday I tried to have as much variation as possible. One minute we were flying into Frankfurt in the 787. Just need to and get then, over that ridge? Like, you know, two hours later, oh, I was yeah, doing yeah. this in northern Norway with Candace, and it's just, yeah. It's, it's, I'm just, yeah, just so impressed. Testing the suspension out. Kind of dream, right? Because <clears throat> we can just, it's Bush just, just so admin. easy to have some good variation. It was fun watching non-flying people yesterday. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, oh, God. 
how did your stream go last night, Kat? I that was good. A little bit. Yeah, it was good. Did a lot Lisa, I hope we can't wait to get out, on it. A3 Trinity already fixed. It's still rocking. So um, the rocking's the, fixed. Yeah, like, the onboard avionics on the on the big airliners are still, like, they need quite a bit of work still. So it looked like the weather was about an hour to an hour and a half behind. Um, did see the squall line, but we did not match what was in what was current. Interesting. So live weather is not live weather. Yeah, it looks like it's still a significant delay there. Right. Okay. That's interesting. Now that That's being good. said, I did a I did a flight into the marine layer a couple weeks ago in LAX, and it was bang on, like it was spot on. It was also burning off as I was coming in too. It was really cool. Mm. Right, who are we following? I'm following Sai at the moment. No I like you. Oh, there's another man down to our left. Oh, this, this oh, looks so oh, good yeah. flying into the sun. Look at this. Sai, look at the dip just before it. Are we aiming like a glove, think of seven months. Uh, yeah, like there's a yeah the, bigger, this plane is a lot of fun. Just if you want to just go flying around the bush and landing in random places, this is the plane. Oh, preparing. Oh, that looks like bomb, dude. Hey, this is your warning to check which fuel tank you're using. Uh-oh. Hey. <laughs> oh, Thanks, yeah, chat. I'll do, that. I'll do that when we're on the ground. I got yeah, which instrument view is it? There we go. It's got a bit of a bump in it, though. So. Are we aiming for this one close to us, yeah? It's approaching right now. Okay. Land in the bush. Yeah. It's called a bush plane because you can just land in the bush or yes, I have, like I random places. Confirm. Not in a bush, in the bush. It is landable. Okay. Oh, I see where you go. Oh, you went by okay, the uh, trees. Oh. Fuel I've been given cake. Failure. Don't ask me how I know. It is dangerous. <laughs> Have a look on YouTube. You There's some the crazy way, videos of people doing it in IRL. I sure did. It happens. I actually it happened to me all the time. Like you just, you just, you grab it, and some of them you drag to the right, some you drag to the left. And it's never the same, and it's never what you expect. Select the right fuel tank. Nice. Paying for premium seems like a waste. Depends, you get 10 airports. Hey. This is early access. It's the final build, <clears throat> but it's basically a media key. So water is a little off-putting, but uh, yeah. yeah, it's a little weird. Yeah, I'm trying to climb over a box canyon made of water right now. I thought you were just going for a quick bath by the looks of it. Apparently I'm swimming. I was going to say, it looks like you're paddling. You are uh -oh. swimming, indeed. <laughs> I may actually be floating in the water right now. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's Don't sad. mind me. <laughs> oh, uh, no, all the rooms are not this bad. That's what we call doing a chewy. <laughs> very nice. Hey, I only ended up on my nose in the water twice yesterday. Should we, um, Ty, should we go over to Hope and um, do some yeah, proper stuff? There's some better sandbars there. Why don't we go to Hope and we'll switch over to the other cub, too? Okay. That great. Yeah, I'm done with that. Uh, so the airport code is C Y H E. C Y H E. All right, let's do this. I kind of like with the multiplayer how like you don't have to wait for everybody and then it loads you all in. Like you can just. I know it's a simple thing. Yeah. C Y H E. Hope. Hope. Let's hope that I have some more success with my landings. So I'm gonna. I'm, gonna, I'm <laughs> jumping in the the shock ultra. That's what I was flying yesterday, and that thing's great fun. 
Sorry, how do you hey, just jump into hey, another? I recommend you take the uh, the actual Savage. Uh, I think oh. you'll enjoy that. Better, honestly. Okay, the Savage Cub. Yeah, the yellow one that you're in. Yeah. Switch yeah. over to another airport. We exit so out. So you're going to have to go. Yeah, you're oh, going you back to the main menu. Out. I thought you guys were just doing it from inside. Okay. What what what's the airport uh, designator again? C Y H E. Yeah, just filling up the fuel. Copy now. Thanks, fifty three. Straight back in. I don't see aluminium strutting you're using, uh, Gray Man. I haven't on the equipment list. I haven't put the rig information in yet. I need to do that when things calm down with this thing. I need to make a video on the rig and then I'll do the um, specs for it. But basically, this is a Simlabs P1X. If you go to simlab.eu and look for the P1X, that's what this rig is. Uh, with, with a multiplayer tuned in, you can basically create a group, invite your friends, and um, you can then either fly with only that group or you can fly with everybody in the world. You love to see my stream deck. It's completely work in progress. Happy anniversary, Nata. I'll do back there. Uh, especially we'll take the up. cub and your MP group and go to southeast Alaska so, and land yeah. on the glaciers. Just figure out how to turn this on. Land on the glaciers? I've never done that. One guy's suggesting that at some point we go to southeast Alaska and land on the glaciers. Ooh. You know, I was going to say I've never landed on a glacier. <laughs> glaciers are like super tricky to land on because they're, they've got like cavities that are filled with snow and it's uh, dangerous stuff. Yeah, you only get one shot, right? Otherwise, you're in the water. <laughs> I like the sound of this thing. Uh, how the heck uh, the we start this? Are, the Rotax sounds are amazing. Uh, they've nailed it on all Mission. the Rotax airplanes. Really good. Cabin heat, choke lever. Have I actually flown this thing? Where's the battery master? Avionics. Where's the battery is, master uh, on this? Is Psy the only one that's shown up as a as a cub for me? The X cub? Oh, I think I didn't change my aircraft. Hang on. I uh, should be able to get into the same spots. As I have the dumbs, I'm in the middle of like eating a salad. Hang on. What kind of salad? It's just a Caesar. Chicken Caesar. Okay. I like salads. It's basic, but it's the best salad. What are Breaks, you blah, blah, blah. That's what we're here for. <laughs> choke. It does. It doesn't choke is happy. on. Okay. Oh. Deep inside. Throttle uh, is closed. Right. We master clear. switch. Where's the master so switch? What, what, what salad does the almighty cat straighter oh. have then instead of a Caesar salad? And the one that doesn't have any lettuce. It's on there. Interesting. <laughs> what? Um, Potato salad. Nishan's on. Um, right. Meat. Turn the key, throttle. French fries. Right, right. What I'm saying is I don't need... Uh, what I'm saying is the fat guy doesn't need salads. Probably can stand to have a couple ah. more of them, but... If you haven't seen me... You haven't seen me in COVID, li COVID life. Oh, I see. Okay. <laughs> Steve PHL says lettuce is crunchy water, basically. All right. I lost three kilograms over lockdown, and I was really proud of myself oh God. until my... Um, my personal trainer reminded me that it was probably all muscle mass, not. It's a Rotex. <laughs> yeah, I've never flown this one. Kills my vibe, bro. But... Um, <laughs> yeah, I have a PPL. I don't have a commercial or anything. Oh my god, the seats in position. What's going on? There we go. So we're flying at C Y H E Hope today. Do we know anything about this airport? Say again. Do we know anything about it's Hope Airport? Hope. Yeah, Hope we want to go out of here to the north. E like east northeast, I believe. 
and then lights. Uh, CYHG is located 2.6 nautical miles west of Hope Town site with the municipal district of Hope, British Columbia. It's home to the Vancouver Soaring Aviation. Yeah, there you go. Where the hell are the parking? That's flaps. Let's on. Actually, we're going to go to the west. Sorry, we're going to go straight out of here. Uh, tell me no some more about No instrument light in this Can thing. Can you find me the, the 15 best things to do in Hope? Canada. Hope is notable as being the location of a Boeing demonstration of the Boeing 737's landing and takeoff abilities. Yeah, the checklist thing is really good, Nightcrawler. It he works so well. Wow. Uh, 733 is here. <laughs> yeah, can you yeah. imagine that? <laughs> I want to see that video. There you go. I, but this is, uh, this is one, I know it's cheesy as hell, but it's quite cool to do just to Google where you are and find out some cool things about the place. The 15 best things to do in Ho uh, oh, no. Actually, there is... Right, everything's about out. doing outdoor stuff. Oh, so, that's it for the Rocky movies. Oh, here we go. Number one top attraction is the Othello Tunnels. Right. Number two is the Coquihalla Canyon Provincial Park. Ah, uh, here we go. The number three is the Hope Slide. Uh, White Eagle it is, but only for the basic stuff. <laughs> so Not to be confused with the electric slide. slide. You don't have any land. As in, the checklist or item will essentially land get land you to start the engine, side. but I'm after that, there's not we'll a lot. Do outside stuff. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for, for man. How far do I have to go for the first bar? Uh, Le Shed bar. is the number 12 thing. It's a shopping. That's a pretty I'm beautiful sight. We're a gaggle of cubs. It's pretty amazing. Yeah, I want to find a bar, though. Drop your bar. I went through, there's 30 things on here, and none of them are a bar, so. Sorry, guys. There's a fudge shop at number 27. Can I get some of that, um, what was it called, Sorry, that stuff? Where was it? Poutine or something? Oh, that's right. When we went to, yeah, when we went to Maine. Yeah, yeah. That, that stuff. I want some more of that. Are you guys all familiar with the wonders of poutine? Favorite no. thing ever. No. Okay, Negative. Matt, do you like french fries? Uh, well, yes. Look at the size of me. Do you like, do you like cheese? No. Oh. <laughs> well, I killed it. <laughs> Look at him. Hear him deflate. Well, right. thank you very much, guys, for coming out tonight. It's been fun. Uh, <laughs> I love his portion. <laughs> Is it melted cheese? Are we all here? We got. We, we, are we gonna fly? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm game. We're all good, I think. Swiftly. No, uh, swiftly is not. Swiftly is not the word I would use. Moving on at a very steady pace. There you go. Deliberate. Whoa. This, uh, this thing is so much nicer to fly than the. Yeah, I was going to say, I'm already enjoying this aircraft more. <laughs> and it's, it's so, the most realistic tail dragger on the, on the sim this far for me. I haven't actually flown this thing yet, so this is kind of exciting. Same. I use the, uh, I can't remember whether the other version of this is the one that's in the premium deluxe version, but they've got two slightly different versions of this, did you say, Panda's Night? Because I was playing the white one yesterday. Yeah, the, the Chuck has a different weight. Panda's, his, thank uh, you very much for lighter, subbing. So, oh, okay. it's, uh, yeah, it's basically the same, but just slower. So, Staldino tells me that it's called Chips and Gravy in the northern UK. Uh, Chips and Gravy. That's not really poutine, chips, though. Chips, yeah, chips and gravy is not equivalent to poutine. Poutine is, okay. like, yeah. Well, uh, JP, did you say you haven't had poutine? You've had poutine, right? Uh, I don't think I have. It does sound very familiar, but... Oh, okay, so it's french Basically fries a plain cone for you. and gravy and melted cheese curds. And you put oh, them all together. Oh, this is the Canadian thing. Uh, yes, so like, Canadian thing, I, yeah, yes. PC yeah, Tech, I, I, thank I, you I, very, very much, sir, oh, for so five good. subs gifted. It was disappointing. What? What? It's like it's like Macca's fries with gravy on it. <laughs> it uh, you had bad tea. Don't, don't talk it, about, uh, tea. about that. I don't know about that. There's not enough meat in it for me. Yeah, it doesn't need meat. Um, I mean, it, it wasn't bad, but it, they they I think they oversell it. That's fair. Uh, so I'm running about 4,500 RPMs just cruising here. Yeah. This area is incredible. Oh, yeah. it gets better. <laughs> this, uh, this, so this is where we were flying when Paul recorded that multiplayer session a couple yeah. minutes ago. 
Chewie's face not impressed. <laughs> We did, it uh, actually sounds uh, bad, but it tastes yeah, so good. Norway yesterday, and that was that was pretty fun. I don't know if it was as cool as this, but I think this is the best that I've found so far. Mm. And actually, so Heli Pilot found this, and he lifted it from a flight chops video. Oh, uh, really? <laughs> <laughs> it's like they were out doing out doing all their stuff, and he saw on four flight where they were at. He's like, oh, let's go check that out. I feel like the Norway spot we had, Chewie, was pretty damn sick. Yeah, I was really, uh, really enjoying that yesterday. Is this what Chewie saw more oh, I have no idea. Top. What am I using for control? Yeah. What water to land into. So there you go. So, keyboard here. I was just questioning when they're going to some machine guns throttle to down here. Some dog fighting. Thrustmaster yeah. stick over here. Ignore that, that's for trucking. Attack. Two stream decks. Ignore Just that, that's right for driving and racing. <laughs> a lot of pedals are down there, but you can't see them. MFG crosswinds. And I'm only rendering in a window that's 21 by 9 at the moment, not the whole widescreen. Exactly what's up his tree, I'm sure. That's the next PMD And then he'll come hug you on stage. But you see that whole 21 by 9 window. Hey, that wasn't like, me feel guilty about that. What they call ultra widescreen. That's I knew about. PC specs, exclamation mark specs. I didn't see him come up on the stage. And I was, somebody was, I think, somebody was answering a question. So, okay, right, context if people don't know. It was myself, uh, Kat, we're all, Jeff Avignano, and was Brendan there? Was it Durka as well? Uh, Durka or maybe Aerosim, I don't remember who yeah. the was. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, no, it was, yeah, it was Aerosim. So we did a, a question and answer at Flight Sim Expo, and halfway through the q and I'm just sat there chilling, and suddenly I feel somebody basically grip me around the neck and like bear hug me from behind. That's the only way I can describe it. And I had no idea who in the heck this person was. And, and it was a fan. Everybody's, everybody's <laughs> eyes like drawn to me. My face went red, not just because of me being bear choked. Um, and all I hear in my ear was, it's Randaza. That was it. <laughs> hey, off no, our right wing here, you want to try that? My life. <laughs> Scariest of my Did life. Did he take you in his keep... private plane? <laughs> hey, that thing looks awesome. I've seen that play, man. That thing's amazing. Yeah, I was supposed to be going to see it at Duxford, um, but then they were de a delayed by a day um, in Iceland with weather, so I, I couldn't get the chance to go to see it. It'll open up. There'll be some stuff here soon. Oh, Mr. Yeah, Navarin, thank you, 45. Good, yeah. Rome, thank you, 70. Anthony B, welcome back. Yeah, this terrain's just gorgeous. This thing I feel is so much easier to hand fly. I'm not, I, I'm not feeling like I'm having to trim the thing every 30, you know, milliseconds. It just seems to rise and fall quite a bit. I don't know if that's because of the, uh, the hills on the side. Yeah, it could be. Yeah, I think we're getting some stuff off the hills. You're cruising behind you guys watching like the gaggle of cubs. It's so cool. Yeah, it's nice. I'm just chilling, Anyways, you know? angle of attack. It's so relaxing. I'm just watching the countryside go by. Basically, it's the... There. It's just awesome. Hey Paul, is that is that island in front of us the one that we did? Uh, I think it is. You guys see what I'm talking about? Yeah, 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 right in the middle. Yeah. We can land on there. Oh, the little thing. Yes, it is. <laughs> we can land on there. Yeah, it's tight. You got to get it just right, and if you don't get it right, you get pinged off the other side. All right. Well, should I be the test subject again? Yeah, you need to be at stall speed, right on the cusp of the land. It looks smaller than before. <laughs> Microsoft went in and it edited it after they saw the video. So again, it's right off my left wing. Okay, yeah, it is the right. Right in the middle of the river. This is a tricky one. Uh, angle of attack is basically the the angle the wing is presenting to the flowing air mass. Think of it that way. It's important for lift. I'm really well Commander Mac Monkey, thank you two months. Z Rider, welcome. Uh, no, that's the right one. Yeah. That's oh, it's definitely yeah. coming from the other direction. But so much easier to land. If I can get down in one piece like that, then I mean it's going to be a piece of cake. Yeah, we did do it in the other cub. I don't know if there's any difference. Oh, this thing, it's so much easier at like a stall speed. It just it hovers. It almost feels like a helicopter in some regard. This thing actually oh, slows same. down too. Yeah. I, I don't know, JP. Can you like explain what that's about? Like why? Uh, it's just got BG's vortex generators on the wing, and it's a very light airplane, uh, lightly wing loaded. So yeah. it's uh, it's built for this, basically. 
The x cub is actually not built for this kind of proper hardcore. It's a, it's a rich man toy. I can already tell this is going to be way easier. Is there a stall horn? Oh, yes, there is. I just found it. I'm hearing it quite a lot right now, so yes. There's absolutely a stall horn. <laughs> oh, there it is. This looks so wicked watching you guys come in in formation. That formation landing was awesome. Yeah, yeah. I need oh, to this watch that. Amazing. I need to, I need to watch that on someone's stream. I need to watch that back on someone's stream. That looked that looked pretty cool. It's like JP. Uh, I had the drone out. I had the drone. That was out, fun. So it looked nice. good. Yeah, that is definitely a lot easier in this thing. Oh yeah. Oh man, that's cool. Yeah, because I think all of us pretty much went off the end. Yeah. Amazing. <laughs> so many cubs. The, yeah. The uh, the mountains in the background with snow on it, and like it's just insane. Have you guys seen that they've properly fixed the snow preset now? So it, it doesn't, as soon as you like change a cloud layer, it gets rid of the snow on the ground. That was a problem in the preview. Yeah, days. that was an. I reckon they did it deliberately. Do you reckon? I mean, they, they fixed it straight away. I was just doing some stuff in Austria yesterday and it oh, like changes the game again. Although I think the trees might need a little bit of work with some more snow on them and things, but. They look crazy. Hey, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. But as soon as I changed, as soon as I changed, the snow went away again. Hey guys, can you see the rainbow behind me? Oh, snow just popped in. Um, yeah, let's go. I mean, snowy bush flying. That's kind of fun. Maybe this. for some snowy bush flying. It might be heavy on my my frames, but I don't know. Yeah, can you can you guys also see that rainbow? Yeah, I can see the rainbow. Yeah. Uh, I don't see a rainbow. I can see a double rainbow again. Oh shit, yeah, there's a rainbow. Holy crap. Let's see that. And there's a slight double rainbow. Scenery is top notch. Left out. Yep. Oh yeah, there's definitely one, yeah. Like the snow on this island doesn't smoothly transition, it just, yeah, it's like a rectangle. Pops out, yeah. To be fair, there'd be a lot of ice in this water as well. Yeah, that's one thing as well that I wondered if it would model. Uh, I'm gonna leave like this, or? Uh, PC weather. Tech, it injects real uh, weather. It, it does yeah, inject yeah, real weather. weather. Yeah. Uh, yeah. If you choose live cool weather, that's exactly again, what like, you get. None of us have and to uh, it's dynamic and it works really, and it really well. It instantly switches for all of us with a click of the button. That that's, yeah, that's actually really, really, really yeah, yeah, that's, that's true. So if you can sick. see the boundaries, it's easier. Okay. Cool, I'll get out of here first. Alright, let's do this thing. Where are we headed? Just continue up this river. I am starting to fall in love with the cub a lot. Oh, this thing takes <laughs> off so well. Yeah, this, this is better than the other cub. I'll admit it. Doesn't look as pretty, but it looks, it sounds better. I like so the engine sound as well. Yeah. And it's really easy to put it in the yellow arc. <laughs> okay, so we'll just roll it. Like a muscle car, honestly, it's so powerful. If you're going to roll this thing, I don't know how much nose up you want before you make the turn, but it's not like an FA18 where you can just go 10 degrees nose up and then make the flat turn. Yeah, so it's no bar barrel roll. It's uh, sorry, it's no roll. It's a barrel roll. So you want to stay positive throughout it. But it, it rolls pretty nice in real life as well. Let's try Isn't that. Isn't that the scariest thing you've ever done? <laughs> no, definitely not. <laughs> Come on, there's a story. I can tell there's a story behind this. Then scariest experience in an aircraft like Woo. this. Yeah, Works pretty well. Like this, Although uh, I nearly I hit the uh, the red line on the speed. Diving out of my friend's kid fox, and my foot got stuck oh. on exit. And so, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'll give you that one. Did you? For a flight sim game, it looks really good. Anyway? Well, nah, I died. bear in mind that you basically. <laughs> This is what you get by default. Like, everything you get here is what you get. 
all the aircraft, all the scenery, by default. That's crazy. And yesterday, after the end of uh, our bush flying, we were both crying with laughter. So that's the goal for this one as well. I'd love yeah, them to put a replay cool. function in this sim. I really, so really would. If they put a replay function in this hey, sim, you'll get you some doing? amazing uh, videos. No, I'm no, no, I'm not repeating that one from yesterday. What happened? So, yesterday, I, asked, I caught the uh, ass. What do you guys do in cruise? Like asking how I keep myself occupied in cruise in airliners when I'm not flying this kind of fun stuff. Uh, he went really silent after I spent about two minutes explaining everything that I did in cruise on my stream to then find out that he was actually asking what my cruise speed was. <laughs> ah, yes. <laughs> did you tell him about the part where you uh, turn the stream off and go for your piano lesson for half a day? <laughs> <laughs> the best part was when he told me he did, usually digs his nose during the cruise. That's how he started. Ah, yes. I mean, what else are you going to do? You don't get the stream deck. No, I'm talking about in the sim. I'm not talking about my equipment. Like, as in, you get all this scenery. You get the airports that you see. Everything that you see in the sim is what you get. Probably three years at least. How does it run on HD? I don't know. I, I never bought a hard disk drive I mean, for my machine. I have no clue. Oh, I feel like there's some riverbank system banks here, here for sure coming up. There's like an island on the just to the right, like far right of the bridge. By the way, get an Xbox controller, even if it's just for the drone cam. Can we go under the bridge? The drone cam with an Xbox ah. controller is so good. You can like zoom in, zoom out. You can do a barrel roll. Bridge. Yeah, you guys see it like dead ahead of me. And there's a you can lock it on the aircraft. Two islands to the right in the middle of the water. I can do that one sec. A load of trees just despawned for me. Oh, that's interesting. That's uh, it's that deforestation. Too many <laughs> emissions. Rip. That's Sorry, a real problem, you know. The lock button's been remapped. It happens. You can basically lock it on an aircraft and then follow it around. Airspeed. Oh, it's fine. My airspeed's over 200 knots. Does it really matter? Oh, there's a bridge. Yeah, I know, right? Anyway, if the thing goes 200 knots, under I'll be or very over? Impressed. Oh, it's kilometers. It's kilometers. Uh, so that's like that's like 30 knots, right? No, like 27, really. Okay. Goes under the bridge. How many stones is that? <laughs> Three and a half, I think. Are you guys aiming for the bridge? Are you guys going to go under it? Of course. That's the plan. We're going to shoot it down. It's a vital right. part of uh, Canada's. Are we going to be the dam? It's key infrastructure. We need uh, to test it. Is that a sim racing setup as well? Yeah, sim racing, sim so driving. Again, ten times faster. You just swap rigidity. some equipment around. I wasn't 10 times faster, though. Once rigidity. you built a rig, you can basically that's configure that's it however you want it. Oh, this one's easy. Oh, OK. That looks so cool from this view. It says minus three feet for you, Ty. Yeah, yeah. Reset the barrow. Done. Ah, there you go. <laughs> right, Paul, we're going to do a... Oh, wait, I was going to see if we can time it together at the same oh, time. Oh, you're, you're way in front of me. I'm right next to Sai. Okay. Oh, Sai, yes. Oh, that looks so cool. There you go. <laughs> that is awesome. <laughs> oh, God. Jones, thank you for the bits. Newty, thank you for five years. Wow. Now, do we think we can land on the bridge? Easy. It's quite narrow, if I remember. Easy. Things are a piece of cake to land, right? Are we in the utility category? I think this thing is always in the utility guy. Yeah. <laughs> there's actually, there's a, there's a Cub G3 that's about you for the five north years, of mate. me, but uh, I'd have to have like a 70 pound instructor to get signed off on it. I don't think the bridge physics are very kind. Uh oh. Oh, no. I... Oh, you've just gone straight through. Direction is uh, high, so that's not an option. Right. What, you can't the, land on the bridge? The bridge is not solid. No, it's got very high friction, as if almost like what beach sand should be. 
Ah. I'll just watch Ty first. Now. Okay. We tried. Are you slewing up in the air? Your like models just disappeared for me. Oh, oh God! Never mind. <laughs> 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 what, what I miss? Uh, you went through the bridge and crashed into the water. <laughs> it, was, it was fine for like a second, then I hit the wall. Uh, Oops. Yeah. Oh dear. So the slew options for this sim, I think, are in the camera menus, aren't they, right? Uh, yeah. Just press Y. Yeah, press just y. press Y and it'll <laughs> pick yourself back up again. As I discovered yesterday with my water landings. Uh, third edge, thank you for year. Evan Bevan, welcome. Uh, have you flown IRL? I fly a Cessna 172. Uh, like in real life. too aggressive flying this airplane. Nothing like this. I'd love to fly one of these. I'd love uh, to have a go. Around, man. You can have a lot of fun in a plane like this. All right, can we gotta go yeah. find some? Oh. Yeah. yeah the jet a... Sorry. Go ahead. You go. I'm done. No, didn't. Oh, okay. <laughs> I, uh, I say we. I think we should go find the mountaintops, some inclines. Okay. You want to leap? Sure. A straight ahead looks pretty, pretty fun. Straight ahead. <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll overtake you, Cat Straight. Yeah, he's lowing on your left, I think, Paul. Yeah, I see him now. He was behind me saying straight ahead. I had no idea where that was. <laughs> so, uh, Cat Straight, your pole and. There's Psy, Cyanide, and who else was here? Oh, Castrate is Ty. So I'm playing right. Ty. So you've got Ty and Psy. Yeah. Ty and Psy. Yeah. And then you've got Squirrel and Cat. Well, yeah, Squirrel and is Paul, that's me. You're Paul, yeah. I'm even confused now. Am I Psy? No, no, you're Ty. Chewie's Phi, and I'm high. Psy, Phi, hi, hi, Ty. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, nice to virtually meet you all. <laughs> Whatever that means. Lovely as well. <laughs> Is it possible to fly yeah, through Tower Bridge? I think Tower Bridge. Uh, during the preview build, Tower Bridge was a uh, an invisible wall. Maybe they've changed it. Because you're just walking away from me, and I don't know why. Can I climb or anything? Probably a fuel thing. Yeah, it's because you need to lose some weight, so. Hey. Yeah, what's the field jettison button? <laughs> Just stick a knife in the side of the thing. You think in this hill? You think in this hill up here on our right? Uh, Look at the color of the water. How cool right now, is that? Uh, you're pretty it's much absolutely the gorgeous. There. Look at it. It's slightly to the right of you. Okay. Yeah, the green, the big green spot up there. I see. Jules, thank you, forty-seven. Uh, yeah, I looked at it up close, but it looks like there's also a patchy brown area as well. Roger. Uh, can you go tell the white? Yeah, I presume. So much fun. <laughs> I've forgotten to drink my tea. What happens when your plane gets shot? <laughs> Are you getting a spit in the city? Oh, yeah, that's true, actually. I didn't think about that. What's uh, best climb on this? It's called suicide climb, where uh, we're probably not going to make it up the top. Oh, we got to Dubai. This. Yeah, we need to go to Dubai at some point. Have a look around. So we might be right. Oh, I see where you guys are at. Oh, oh yeah, a little break in the trees here. That's not the way I was going for. So yeah. Are you landing there, Chewy? I don't know. I'm following. I'm following JP. Uh, is this a pre-release version? This I is know, the final version. Down, yeah, but but like some of the media guys can access to it. Early. Yeah, I mean. It, it's what I don't understand though is why they don't let people preload the game. The Even if you can't fire it up, why do they let you not let you preload it? Because when you install the game, you then fire it up, it then does a 95 gigabyte download. And on release day, I would reckon that's going to get fairly busy. Yeah, all right. So uphill, but uh, definitely doable. I'll, I'll lead us in. Cool. There's a nice little rope. That I'm going to land on. Oh, um, you can preload so on Game Pass. Oh, that's good. 
What about steam? Are you landing in the, the thing? Yeah, in that little break in the trees where you can kind of see a road. I'm following JP in now. God, I love this cop. So good. Oh, yeah, it looks like there's nothing to it. <laughs> 